I used to think the song Eternal Flame was written by Atomic Kitten until my Bang. devastated mother was like, no way, it was the Bangles first, and the Bangles were the original girl band. Those harmonies are so spot on and I think it's Susanna who's singing lead and her vocals are spot on the, rhythmically so in the pocket but her tone is so unique and solid as well. It's actually a much trickier song than it sounds. It sounds really easy, she makes it sound easy but it's constantly over the break and you're having to negotiate your registers quite a lot so it's pretty tricky. Eternal Flame was written with Billy Steinberg and if you don't know Billy Steinberg he also co-wrote things like Like a Virgin and True Colours by Cindy Lauper. So he was a bit of a prolific songwriter and this was another one of those amazing songs that came out of his brain. I watch you when you are sleeping, you belong with me. She has such a twanginess to her voice, yet a warmth. It's so, it's so lovely. I love the, um, mm, sunshine through the rain, making the sunshine a little bit breathier. An eternal flame. How she flips that up to her head voice as well. And she still manages to maintain her tone. You can hear her lose a little bit of core closure and a little bit of breathiness come through, but that's on purpose to, you know, let the end of the phrase kind of float away. You don't want it too heavy at this point. Although she is also able to do a mighty mix here. You can hear that it's very solid. She's a soprano, so her register break is probably a little bit higher than the average woman as well so she can kind of get above that break quite easily I think that this is playback vocals on the backing vocals, but I love those. Ah, ah, ah. There's a little scoop up and a scoop down and they're doing it in perfect harmony and it's just so beautifully blended. I know that's partially the production, but it's really, really beautifully balanced. Now, I want you, this is the bangles, and I would like you to listen to the voice of Susanna Hoffs, the singer, and think, where do I know that voice? It might not be from where you think. If you don't know the bangles, her voice has popped up somewhere else. The whole life is a lonely, and then come and ease the pain. I don't want to lose this feeling. Have you got it? She was the voice of Courtney Amber in The Powerpuff Girls. Um, she also just did a fantastic vowel instead of so or anything that's an oo or an o, oh, she's really changing it so. I'll point it out if she does it again, but she literally is making it sa instead of so, so she doesn't close her mouth and she's keeping that airflow going. Beautiful. Close your eyes, give me your hand. Give me a 
little bit of vocal fry there. Do you feel my heart beating? Do you understand? Do you feel the same? Am I only dreaming? Or is this burning an eternal flame? That mix! That was so good! That was a really delayed reaction because I was just so like, I didn't expect it, especially after Will it feel the same? Up into that head voice. Flame! Yeah, it's, it's pretty high to get that kind of heavy, heavy mix, but it was so balanced and she has that kind of, that power there from, that kind of soprano power, I love that. Huskiness as well. A head voice version this time. It's so spot on pitch wise. <laughs> it's such an interesting voice. It's so light, there's a little bit of rasp in there and it really stands out and cuts through, which is beautiful in these lovely harmonies that they've created throughout, that you have this cutting voice and the rest are just this beautiful together, very, very well pitched and well balanced blend. Really, really beautiful. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, please do like and subscribe and I will see you in the next one. Bye. Bye.